morning. Yes. Hey, Minxie ladies. We've just got Lynn in here. She's um, one of our lovely little Minxie ladies that pops in and checks out our stock. She also works, um, flirts a little bit with working for Magazine Clothing, one of our retailers. Um, that's all throughout the country. Actually, we're at, there's stores everywhere, eh? Magazine Clothing. We've got 11 stores. 11 stores, yeah. So she's one of the beautiful retail assistants in there. Great at styling ladies, if you need some help. Hey, I had a massively busy weekend here at the HQ. Saw so many of our wonderful retailers, and I just thought I'd give them a quick shout out um, because some of these ladies um, you probably work with, or shop with and, and, um, and visit. So uh, we saw Jeanette and Ray from Holland's. They are um, they came in and saw, saw us on Saturday. They're all the way from uh, Hastings. See you, Liz. Have a great day. Uh, they're all the way from Hastings. So so lovely to see them. They said their mint collection is growing. They're getting more uh, styles in there, which is super exciting. Um, then yesterday we had, uh, we saw Michaela from Mavis and Mick. She's opened the store in Waihee, ladies, if you're floating around that beautiful Coromandel destination, Waihee Beach. Uh, she's also got the store in Matamata, Te Aumutu and Cambridge. Um, so she was in looking at the new collection and snappled up a few bit, bits of extra clothing and things like that uh, for summer. Um, then we had uh, Sue and Carol from Mainly Casual, also over on the Coromandel. They've got a, a Mainly Casual have got a um, store in Thames, uh, Fidianga and Whangamata. Uh, we missed seeing you, Lynn, actually, um, at the showing. Usually Lynn, who manages the store in Whangamata, comes with Sue, but it was really great to meet Carol, so that was really lovely. Uh, then we had, and I also met for the first time, uh, the lovely Rosemary um, and her um, assistant and her lovely daughter. Um, who had the store Dan Dan in the Hawke's Bay. So uh, Dan Dan's is located in Taradale, uh, Havelock North, uh, Napier, and I'm going to say Hastings, but I could be wrong, but a uh, lovely little store, both clothing and footwear there, uh, Dan Dan's. Uh, and then we saw a wonderful, um, uh, it was Jane, um, and oh, I've just her, the assistant has just slipped my mind there. She's just gorgeous blonde lady. Um, from uh, Jane's Fashions in Matamata, so they do Creed and um, and the footwear. Years ago, Jane used to manage our store in t -Rout, so it's great to have that connection with her store in uh, Matamata. Uh, and then our final appointment of the day was with Doreen from Adore Chapman Shoes in Tikawiti. So um, it was really good to see her as well. Um, and she's also getting a few more styles in with us uh, for her store um, this coming season, which is pretty exciting. Doubling the, the styles that she's getting, which is cool. And then today, ladies, I'm boring you, so I'm just gonna go to my outfit, I think, and then I'll tell you who I'm seeing today while we're talking about my outfit and the girls' outfits. So um, I thought I would put on today my little um, Soho mesh tank slip in the cotton knit, because literally our showings are upstairs and it's against a tin roof and it's like a sauna up there, so we get ridiculously hot. And then over that, um, I've just got my sly slip chiffon layer, and um, it's just like just wearing like a really floaty, easy kind of garment um, when it's so hot uh, upstairs. I thought that I would put my little, I've, I've been wearing my trig sandals every single day, so I thought I'd put my little um, pretty Polly's, oh well, no, Victorious, Victorious pleat, pleat in, yep. uh, on the pink to kind of um, pull out the pink in the, in the dress. The really crazy thing is, we must have all been channeling the pink here in the office today. So I want to show you the girls. Um, Chasing Kate says she loves those trainers. Oh, thank you. We need to see your baby. We need to see your baby. Uh, so yeah, Lisa was also channeling her pink today. And see, she's got her tricks on. See, I knew I didn't need to wear mine. Um, because... She is rocking them. Uh, and she has got her matchy matchy on. So um, it is the reader pant, reader top and the Hayworth pant. Remembering that kind of does up in through the back there. And Annie's yeah, should we get Annie in? Little Annie, stage, stage right this morning. Uh, so Annie also, new purchase for Annie. She grabbed also, oh, we're getting lots of love hearts and yay and all that kind of thing. Uh, and he's got the Rita top on and the pink. And her pants that she's got on, ladies, are the uh, Palazzo pant in the black knit. So um, the Palazzo pant in the black knit has this wonderful drape and cotton feel to them. Um, Lisa's just pulling out the other colorways. Oh, yeah, Nanny does too. 
so they've got do you want to Annie just pull out that they've got like a little vented side flap there but it is stitched yeah see that there so on they can almost give the drama of a full gourd skirt although it's not um yeah they're super super beautiful and their leases yeah they are comfy yeah you wear these quite a bit in white lace very 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 nice so that is the palazzo pant thank you oh look at it go uh lovely girls for a toe jane saying lovely girls uh now also let's um nay let's bring in nay stay oh she is looking <laughs> no you can't get out of it you can't slime out of it nay that's not very nice um so yeah nay has got on uh the fine knit tea the fine knit oh, tea yes. and i like, actually love how you've styled that nay she's just put like a little basic white cami on underneath so um, cute with the little is, view yeah it is really cute really really cute so that looks lovely and then she's paired that back with her uh swan lake chill skirt uh now ladies these have sold out i feel like they've nearly sold out everywhere i think most yeah. of our retailers are ringing in hot trying to order more of these skirts uh, i can tell you that they have been ordered and they have been produced but they're just on the slow rowboat rowboat from china at the moment uh, yes. she's wearing that back with her little bandit sneakers in the poochie inspired print yeah. what i like about that is that the all those sort of dusty shades of the skirt and the shoes kind of all tone in really nicely particularly with those free tour jan said another beautiful lady oh, thank <laughs> you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so ladies today i'm super excited and privileged to have another batch of wonderful retailers and seeing our new summer collection mm. So I'm going to be seeing any moment now um, the gorgeous, gorgeous Lee from Body and Souls on uh, Waiheke Island. She caught the morning ferry uh, to cross the straits there to come and see us. So I'm looking forward to seeing her. Uh, we've also got um, Carolyn coming in from Carpenter's Daughter. A uh, little shout out to Carolyn from Carpenter's Daughter. You may not know, but she's opened a little pop-up store, workroom, showroom. Uh, down at the Winyard Quarter in a uh, beautiful retail complex down there. Lovely big store. You can walk in there and literally see the girls making patterns, uh, sewing up garments, doing live photo shoots and things like that. Lots of drama down there. So uh, if you haven't been down there and you're up here floating around that Winyard Quarter area, go and have a look at the store. It's gorgeous. Uh, and then we've got lovely Anne from Sphera coming in. She's got a lovely store over in Birkenhead. Uh, I'm super excited also to see Rach. Uh, Rach is coming up from H&J Smiths in Invercargill. So it'd be good to get the goss on what H&J Smiths are doing um, with their department store moving forward. Uh, they've got, of course, a store in um, Dunedin and another store in Queenstown. I think they might have closed their Balclutha and Tikapo stores. So I'll get the goss on that and I'll be able to tell you tomorrow, um, Central, Lower, South Island ladies. Um, and then uh, I think that's about it. I'm catching up with the girl next door, uh, Willow Shoes, uh, later tonight, and then seeing them tomorrow. So, yeah, that's my diary for the day, ladies. Chasing um, Kate says, Love this, Renee. Tote's going to copy it. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, I would too. I would too. It looks really And great. Stephanie said, Gorgeous outfit. Maybe need those multicolored shoes, Nay. Yeah. Uh, yeah Stephanie also that. said, Feeling a bit limited in Dunedin with stockists. I know. It's so disappointing. You really need to go down. Whoever it is that you like to shop with in Dunedin, ladies, um, the best way is from the ground up. So you as a consumer, go into your local favourite retailer and just say, hey, I'd like to see Creed or I'd like to see Minx in here. Uh, and then they'll reach out and connect with us. We've reached out to a couple of stores, but they just haven't been picking it up. Uh, we do stock frames down in Dunedin and Hanover Street. Um, they're, they're always been a wonderful supporter of Minx. But in, in, as far as like downtown Dunedin Central, there isn't anywhere. And we would dearly love to be stocking someone down there. So yes, do reach out to your local retailer down there and ask if they would um, connect with us. Bridget said Dunedin H&J closed. Yeah, it has yeah. closed. Oh yeah, thank you. I know, it's so sad. I feel like, you know, it's been what well, was Arthur Barnett's and then H&J Smith's and it seems kind of unreal that there's no department-y type um, fashion store down there anymore. Big opportunity for someone to pick up that business though, ladies. Farito Ajan is wanting to know if we have the Rock Bay in a 35 or 36 available. Yeah, uh, let's have a look for you. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba, Rock Bay, ladies, is this style here? Uh, we had a retailer come and pick up a whole lot 
uh, over the weekend. Um, looks mm -hmm. like the smaller size we have is a 37 at the moment. Uh, but of course we can try and connect you with a retailer that may have that size for you. Yeah. I think that's all for today. That's all for today. Uh, super cool. All right. Well, you ladies have a lovely day today. And uh, we will catch up with you tomorrow. I'll fill you in on all the goss tomorrow from my retailers. <laughs> See ya.